Hi, I'm Ed Robbins with the Co-op Tires, Batteries, and Accessories Department, and you're watching a Co-op Minute. Today we're going to be talking about hydraulic oils, and we're going to find out that not all hydraulic oils are created equal. The first product we want to show you today is a mobile equipment fluid. This is a low-cost economy hydraulic oil that is used primarily in applications in the early 70s and earlier. This is a good fluid if you have an older piece of equipment or it leaks out as fast as it goes in. As tractors evolved, we find that many changes took place in the transmissions. You have wet brakes, you have solenoids, you have a lot of more complex components inside that transmission and there's metals in those transmissions and we need to protect those. So the next step would be the high shield and this is produced by Cenex Ford Co-op. It's a great fluid. It's a J20C spec oil, which meets all current specs. It is offered only at the co-op, and it comes in that awesome orange bucket. Your Quick Lift HTB has your maximum package of additives as far as dispersants, antioxidants, and detergents. And this is important because it protects the metals in the transmission, it protects the solenoids, it helps keep the heat down in the transmission, which can cause solenoids to stick. And so that's the reason we want to look at a premium fluid. Some tractors will require a low viscosity formula, whereas this is a 10W30 viscosity, this is a 5W20. Then we're seeing this fluid come on as a more popular one because a lot of today's tractors are requiring synthetic oils. And so if the Maxtron THF Plus is a synthetic oil, whereas these are natural conventional oil. The number one thing we want to remember when we're choosing a fluid for our tractor is that we consult the owner's manual and we pick the proper fluid for the application. If you don't have an owner's manual for your particular piece of equipment, you can stop by your local co-op store and they can call in or, or use a, a similar guide like this that will have all the popular makes and models of machinery. It will tell the proper fluid that each machine takes and the amount of fluid that it requires for the change. Thanks again for joining us in this Co-op Minute and check back next week for more tips.